Alright guys, so it's day 123. We're still on our trophy push to Champions League. I know it's super hard. And I hope one day that we can make it to Champions League as a Town Hall 9. Currently we're in Master 2. I'm not sure if we can do this. It is super hard to get to Champions League and it's been almost like 4 months. But I know that we can do this. Wait, wait, wait. This guy is a Town Hall 7 and he's in Titans League. Holy shit. Yo, what is going on guys? It's Marcin here. Welcome to the Clash of Clans video. In this video, we're going to be continuing on with our trophy push to Champions League. I don't think we're ever going to make it because, you know, I'm pretty stinky at this game and I don't know about this. But we are going to make it one day. So let's continue on with our push to Champions League. And as you guys saw before, there was a Town Hall 7 who managed to be in Titans League. And I have no idea how that Town Hall 7 managed to be in Titans League. Anyway, we are... If you guys would like to come join my clan, we did have to kick a whole bunch of people because no one would be in wars and they're all pretty inactive. So, please come join and help uh, help fill up the clan. I know, like, after I've posted this video, th there is going to be, like, 50 spots all filled up in, like, 5 minutes. But, you know, if you're lucky, you can probably join in. But pretty much the clan right here... Is gonna be called Savage Seven, and the guy is Zazo Two. So anyway, before we get right into this video, please be sure to leave a like on this video. Let's go for well over 500 likes on this video. I know it's a big like goal on this video, but if every one of you guys can leave a like on this video, support my channel, the Saint Army, as the Saint Army subscribers. I know we can reach 500 likes on this video, so please leave a like just to support me out, and please be sure to subscribe if you haven't already for more videos. So anyway, this guy is a Town Hall 7 in Titans League. I have no idea how this guy does it. We can take a look at his army camps, and he's got 10 level 2 dragons. I'm pretty sure that he goes for Town Hall Snipes, and he uses these dragons on other Town Hall Snipers that a Town Hall 7 like him. He has got a pretty good defensive layout, to be honest. It looks pretty good for anti-air, but I'm pretty sure that I could probably build a better base than this, and probably have, but still pretty nice design. So taking a look at his record, his season record, he has 32 attacks one, which is really good to be honest as a Town Hall Sniper in Titans League. Imagine how many bases have their Town Hall outside. Probably none, except for other Town Hall Snipers. And he has obviously got zero defenses one, which is pretty sad because I'm not sure that people would want to give away free cups in Titans League. So to be honest, uh, he's doing really awesome at the time. And show him your support on this video. Say good job, Zazo. You know, you know what to do. This guy's pretty cool. Hopefully, he can get to maybe the 5,000 cops range. He can keep up the good work. Anyway, let's get right into a raid. So, we're going to be taking a look at one of the most entertaining attacks of the day. This is going to be a Barch raid, which, of course, is like the most entertaining raid, to be honest. But, you know, we've got all of these archers coming in as well as these barbarians. And we're going to see what's going to happen. There is the King and the Queen special ability coming in. We are going for this Town Hall. Because I wanted to get a League. So we're just going to run in for this Town Hall. They are all going to get Giant Bomb. They're just going to get exploded by that huge explosion. But we did take out the Town Hall. Which is really good. And yeah, we did manage to get the Town Hall. But we are not going to be able to get the 50%. But we did do a pretty good attack. We managed to take out that guy's Trap Town Hall and get 33% so not bad raid you could rate that out of a 10 and I'd say that'd be like a like a like a 10 and a half out of 10 but alright let's get into a live raid and I'll see you guys when we hit the live raid alright guys so I found another town hall 9 just like me up here and we're gonna try stuff up his base get a 50% at least and by the way, I'm not really a pro with Barch, but let's see how we go. Wish me luck on this attack. Drop a like on this video. Wish me luck. Anyway, let's get right into this attack. So I'm going to drop my Barbarians over here. Then I'm going to follow them up by Archers. Hopefully we can take out the backside of these buildings. Lead them into the design of the base, into the middle interior design. So let's get inside. Let's keep spreading our troops around. Let's drop our King over there, our Queen over there. Get some troops down. Get our Rage Spell down. Try to get into the design of the base. And we're going to keep dropping our troops around the base because we want to get as much percent as we can. We're going to drop a one of these spells. Uh, I think that's a poison spell. I, I don't even know why I dropped it there. I thought it was a haste spell, but I don't really have those yet. So we're at 44%. We're doing okay. We've got our heroes over here. 
we're gonna try to get to the town hall. We've gotten all the loot. Well, not much of the dark looks, but we're gonna drop that down. Get our uh, heroes uh, villagized up. And that's not even a word of villagized, but we're just gonna get them raged up. Get them shooting on everything. And our queen did manage to clutch the 50%, which is really awesome. We got the 50%. We got a bunch of cups to get us to our Champions League goals. So we are at 2850 trophies. I think that's pretty awesome, but before we end this video, I'm going to show you guys a really cool defensive rate, so this is going to be a little bit of extended video, and if you guys enjoy these videos, be sure to leave a like on the video, because that's a bit better, and let's get right into the defensive replay. So the bonus defensive replay that I've got to show you guys is this super big attack on this guy. This guy's got a level 1 golem, but he's got level 4 Valkyries, level 6 wizards, so I, I have no idea what he's doing. He's going to drop his golems and his giants right into this corner of my base, and they are all going to get pretty much stuffed up, but like... You know, my clan likes to donate me like these level 5 balloons, which is okay. But I did get these massive as level 6 balloons, which is super duper awesome. And level 5, 4 balloons, whatever they are. They're pretty good as well. So he's going to drop in his P.E.K.K.A., his Wizards. As well as more of his troops as into the base of the design. And he's going to get stuffed up. All of his Wizards are getting stuffed up. He's got his Queen over there. The Queen is like, please just don't. And then... He, she, he, his queen is about to get stuffed up. Oh, he's super lucky that the ability larged off. Come on, minion, get him. Oh, the minion died. Oh, get him, Expo. The Expo got the queen. Super duper awesome. All right, now we got this Pekka and this wizard. They're going on a little adventure, but this Pekka is getting pretty much stuffed up. But the Pekka's like, I got you. I got you, bro. But the Pekka's a girl, but Pekka sounds like a guy, but I don't know. But the Pekka's moving in as well as the wizard, and the Pekka got stuffed up. The wizard is going to get stuffed up as well, and this guy managed to get the 43% of my base, and I got 31 trophies from that defense, which is pretty awesome. The extra 31 trophies will super help me out. So anyway, that's pretty much the end of the video. If you want to see more videos like these, be sure to smash the like button as well as subscribe if you haven't already for more of the best videos in Clash of Lands. So that's pretty much it. Peace out, guys.